hi everyone this is Jalissa welcome back to my channel today I have this glam tufted bed that I made for my Remy Remy is my princess this is a dog bed if you're interested in seeing how I made her this bed keep watching subscribe if you already haven't subscribed give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment and let me know what you think Today is Princess Remy's birthday and we're gonna be making her a nice princess bed. We have our palette here that we're gonna be using. You can get anywhere. We also have two dog beds. One is one that she already had and then we just got another one from Walmart. You can get them anywhere. We also have these baby blankets. It's a set of two sheets. Also the quilted play yard sheet that we're gonna be using as well. We have our satin pillowcases that came from the Dollar Tree. Your glue gun. We have these silver gemstones you can get at Walmart or even Michaels. You can get any style that you want. This is the one that we're gonna be using. Your glue gun and your glue. And we need our scissors, some thread, um, some needles. We also have a box cutter we're gonna be using. And <clears throat> We have this to measure things if we need that. Also, we have this dream sign that came from the Dollar Tree. We have our paint, it's chalk paint, it's white that we had from a previous project. Also the acrylic finish. Then we have this foam board. It's kind of, a, it says premium high density. It's a cushion that you can use to make, um, you know, just, it has like an ottoman on the picture there. So you, you can get that at Walmart. And then we have our two foam poster boards that we got from the Dollar Tree. And stay tuned to see how the bed is gonna come out. So for the bed, we're just gonna be taking some pieces off of this pallet to make it a little bit smaller. So now we're going to cut the piece of wood there that's left over for the bed frame. Be cutting both both of them.
I forgot to mention that we're gonna be using two packages of these corner braces and also um, you need an extra long needle. Wood. We just connect, um, putting in the brackets so that you can connect the other piece of wood to it. I went and got these gems because they were way prettier than the other ones I had. And I got these at Michael's. Um, I got four packs. They bring 20, um, 20 pieces. And I'm gonna be using this for the headboard. So we're gluing together the two like cardboard poster boards, the poster boards together. So what we did was after we glued our two boards together, we have these, the satin pillowcases from the Dollar Tree. We cut them into three different pieces and we put it on top. Now this is flipped over. So what we're gonna be doing is gluing it together with the tacky glue. Just wrapping it as if it was a gift. little satin cloth we're gonna be putting it also on the cardboard it wasn't thick enough I'm just gluing it This is our, the foam board. And we're just opening it up. It's the foam cushion from Walmart. We are gluing the satin cloth to the, the cushion with the tacky glue. And again, we're using two this time. We didn't cut them, so it's just the whole pillowcase. We didn't cut them is because it is blue, so we don't want that to show. And this is gonna be for the little tufted part of the bed. So what we did was with the little dots that we made, we're, are, we're using a yarn right now. It's a white yarn. You could use thread. You might want to use a little thicker thread as far as the size of the bed that we're using. So it is a little extra. 
And we're just making the tufted parts. As you can see, we did some already. I'm making one right now. And we're going from the front to the back of it. So Remy's over here waiting patiently, waiting for her bed. Say hi, Remy. So this is how much I've done. It's been, it's taken me a while, but I'm getting there. Almost done, I just got a little bit left. So we decided to sew the ends together so that it's a, like a, a tight fit instead of using the glue for this part. After we've done our little headboard, we have the styrofoam board and we're gonna be gluing it to the headboard, which is gonna give it some support. And we'll be doing it more towards the bottom using the tacky glue. Just like that. Hours later, and she's still waiting for her bed. Look how pretty she is. Got my princess. So the last, well, for the headboard, we're gonna be putting our little gems that we got from Michaels. And we're using the hot glue gun. I forgot to mention that I glued the headboard to the bottom of the wood. And as you can see, Remy loves her bed. <laughs> 